Hi Scorpio, welcome to your daily love reading. My name is Pretty, and I'll be doing your love reading today. So before we begin with your love reading Scorpio, please do remember to take what resonates and to leave behind whatever does not. Okay, so let's begin with your love reading Scorpio. Okay, so at the bottom of the deck, we have the Seven of Swords in the reverse, and this is air energy, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius energy. So this is an energy of someone who is coming towards you very honestly, very open and transparent. Very, there's an energy of a possible confession with this card in the reverse, but they want to keep it real with you. So let's see. We have the Empress, Venus energy, the Three of Cups, water energy, and the Ace of Cups, water energy. So this is someone who is wanting to connect with you in a meaningful, heartfelt way. They could be being vulnerable with you. They could be sharing their feelings with you. This is someone who does have so much love for you and they want to get closer to you. They could be making you a love offer or inviting you out somewhere like on a date or uh, to meet their friends, but this is someone who's expressing love to you, taking action towards you, because they are seeing you as someone who's a prize, someone who's valuable, someone they think highly of. So let's clarify these cards, um, Scorpio. Okay, so we have the Eight of Pentacles, and this is Earth energy, Virgo, Taurus, Capricorn energy. So this is an energy of someone who's putting in effort. This is someone who really wants to make something work. They're going to be consistent. They're going to be, um, you know, driven towards making this a reality, giving it their all. So let's see, we have the Strength card, Leo energy, the Six of Swords, Air energy, and the Justice card, Libra energy. Yeah, this person really wants to be partnered with you. This is someone who will give you their word. With the Six of Swords, there's a peaceful energy, a loving energy from them. Um, this could be someone who has been through a lot. It could be that they have been through a lot with you and they, they are making a promise to make a better effort. Um, they are wanting to make this connection more resilient. Uh, but they know that they have to give more to the situation as well. And it looks like they're ready and willing to do that. Okay, so I'm going to pull out an oracle card for you. Okay, so we have it's time to release negativity full moon in scorpio Okay, we have engagement. Your love life is ascending to a higher level of commitment. So yeah, this person does want to commit to you. They want to really see this through. They want a higher level of commitment here. Yeah. Okay, we have cheerfulness. It is spring again. The earth is like a child that knows poems by heart. Okay, so I'm going to pull out a card for your advice, Scorpio.
Okay, we have surrender your addictions. Whether you're addicted to substances, food, people, sex, or overworking, take action to begin to heal the addiction and replace it with healthier alternatives. Okay, so that's what I'm seeing for you, Scorpio. I hope you have a really, really good day, Scorpio. Bye, Scorpio.